Welcome to the Trojan Windup. I'm Ty Hawkins, bringing you all of the action from week four and taking a look at what's next for USC baseball. Last weekend, USC traveled to Fort Worth, Texas for a three-game series against the TCU Horned Frogs. Game one featured Kyle Davis starting against freshman Lucan Baker. USC got on the board first when Frankie Rios hit a one-out double into the gap. Rios would eventually score on a wild pitch, giving the Trojans a one-to-nothing lead. TCU scored a pair of runs in the second and one in the fifth to take a three-to-one lead. With chances to score in each inning, the Trojans couldn't get back on board until the seventh. After a walk to Lars Newtbar and a single by Rios, A.J. Ramirez came up with two outs and smashed a game-tying double to right center. Ramirez's double wasn't enough, though, as the Frogs would retake the lead in the bottom of the seventh and score four more in the eighth as they cruised to an 8-3 victory. Saturday, the Trojans sent Bernardo Flores to face Brian Howard, and both offenses would come out swinging. USC got a pair of runs in the second on singles by Adalberto Carrillo and Corey Dempster, tying the game at two after three innings. In the fourth, a double by Rios, a single by Newt Bar, and another double by Timmy Robinson would all knock in runs, putting the Trojans up 5-2. to two. But TCU would tie things up in their half of the inning before jumping out to a 10-5 lead in the sixth. Finding themselves down five runs, the Trojans came up in the eighth and showed they still had some fight left in them. Three singles and a walk scored one run, and Newt Bar came up with the bases loaded. Two more runs were in, with still nobody out. Martinez came up next and delivered a sharp single to right. And Robinson smacked one back up the middle to bring home the tying run, and the game went to extra innings. In the tenth, Robinson hit a one-out double, bringing up Ramirez. <laughs> Blast gave the Trojans the lead, leaving them three outs from an amazing come-from-behind victory. But the Frogs rallied in the 10th and won the game in walk-off fashion, winning by a score of 12-11. to On Sunday, the Trojans were looking to avoid a sweep, with Brent Wheatley on the mound against Rex Hill. USC would score first on a double by Robinson, followed by a Ramirez single to bring in a run to take a 2-0 lead. TCU responded, scoring four in the second, knocking Wheatley from the game. Brad Wegman came in relief and shut down the TCU offense for five and two-thirds of an inning, holding them to just one more run. The Trojans' offense would take over from there. USC put up four of their own in the third, capped by this blast by Ramirez. The Trojans added two more in the fourth before tearing the game wide open in the fifth when they sent 10 men to the plate and scored six, making it 14 to four. USC would add another pair of runs in the eighth, and again, it was Ramirez. Gotten out to the two nothing lead. Ramirez hits this one high in the air to deep left field. This one's not coming back, and it is off the scoreboard. Another home run for Ramirez. The Trojans wound up winning the game 16-6, and Ramirez finished the weekend going 6-for-13 with two home runs and nine RBIs. It's a short week for the Trojans as they're back in Los Angeles Tuesday to host the University of Connecticut, followed by the Cal Bears on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. You can see Thursday and Friday's games on the Pac-12 network, while the other games will be streamed live at usctrojans.com as usual. And don't forget, if you miss any of the action, I'll be back here next week to get you all caught up. Thanks for watching Trojan Windup. I'm Ty Hawkins. Fight on.